Yeah, I just want us to summarize on what we did in the last week. And it's a report we on Friday. We are going to talk about the sphere, the cylinder, the cone, the ellipsoid. You have the elliptic cone. That one, it seems like it wasn't in the You have the elliptic uh, paraboloid. And you have the hyperbolic paraboloid. Yeah. We, just have, we just summarize some things more for you to be able to detect. So if you are talking about the sphere, it's going in there. Okay, so you are talking about the sphere. You say what the sphere is not into how many variables? Three variables. X, Y, Z. Where all in terms of the, the variables, the coefficient must always be what? It's a C. The reason why the emphasis is there because the sphere and the ellipsoid they are related. The sphere and the ellipsoid are related. In case, let's pick the general of the sphere. And I said, well, the coefficient must always be the same. So, in case maybe you want something like this. Can we consider this to be a sphere? No. no. Automatically, this has to change to what? Ellipsoid. By doing what? Dividing through by what? Four. You divide through by four, you are getting what? So this becomes what? An ellipsoid. That's why I said the coefficient is very, very necessary. Otherwise, you go into something like this and you might think it's a sphere. You know the variables, the coefficients are not the same. Just make sure that it's always equal to what one and it comes to what and so I hope it's okay. Okay. And, and we know that automatically this is centered at the origin. Yeah, the origin is zero, zero, zero. There's a situation where it's not going to be in this form. Oh, that one we can do it. Complete no squares, you can do it. Or if you take one question on this. Yes. And you can be able to do For the vectors, so you can get the elephant center, everything is in it. The surface. <laughs> <laughs> Describe the surface, whether it's an ellipse or whether it's a sphere or whatever. So, first of all, we just have to do our items. We are going to have our x. So, there is no x. x is only in terms of the only one, right? So, we have our 4 x squared. So, that's our x. So, that's our 4 squared. 
Yeah, that's where someone will stop and say it's a sphere. Can we conclude that it's a sphere? No. Because a sphere, you said what? The coefficient of the variable should be what? The same. For x squared is having the coefficient of x. It's true. y2 is having the coefficient of x. But what about z? Z is not having. So that we have to divide through by what? 4. If we divide through by 4, we are getting what? <coughs> so, by what's So, this becomes what? This becomes what? Ellipsoid. But what's going to be the center? The center of what? Center of negative one. I hope you understand how it's very difficult to But we are going to compare it with x minus h and y minus a and z minus maybe what variable like m. But n h m is h k l. So we are comparing it with this. I guess it's Someone is asking why is this there? Same general form, but in different coordinates. Here in different coordinates. So this is what in 3D. 
the normal service is made to say 2D, 2D, but when it comes to 3D, 3D, we are saying that it's very excellent. I get it. So that means if we have to plot this, that's why the latter was drawing in Luke's attention on how we were using the compass and drawing the center at that time. But that is going to be a form like this, like something like this. You are going to see the interior to be right out of the circle, but those form of the cylinder. That's the Shabala. It takes the same form like how the equation of the circle is. And yet they are in different, different things. This one is XY, this one is XYZ. It's okay. <coughs> okay. <laughs> then move on to what? The form. I move on to a form. The form that is the most children. That's a general form, but a general thing. You see, if you are able to detect that there is a cylinder. Uh -huh. for, for a pool, I also want to produce with a general, a general thing. A general one. Anyone? Okay, so x square and this. Over a plus y square over what is this? Or somehow we can do it like this. That's the general term for it. The general term should be in, in, in mind. But the question that we give it to you in any form, like how we're able to complete um, squares to form the ellipsoid. So the general term is going to be in the challenge. Yeah. 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 So bring that to one side. You won't be get confused because the question is giving to you how to see it. But the question that has to be generated may be uh, a sentence. And if you equate everything to zero, I will find a sentence. Okay. So just make, uh, you always compare to the general term. So write the general term, form it, and compare it with it. That's all. For so that's this one is a long one. It's easy. Yeah, yeah. Why that it will be along the wire the wire. It is not difficult. Let's 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 papa the papa put it. So this one is the form. So let's move on to the elliptic form. That one is what they added, but it's the same thing. We have the elliptic form. Officer, yes. So the elliptic form takes the same form as the, the form. But this one, we are going to have this one. Then z square, s square over e square plus y square over d square. This is down to an elliptic form. So here, for this gen for this general thing, probably to the constant, but for the form, this is Let's become the general thing. The top one. The, I'm going to lay a person because it was the whole set. I don't know where it is. For the general term of the school, please let's use this one. The general term of the school, let's use this. And you have the elliptic. We have the elliptic form, so this form the elliptic form. Yeah, so it, it resembles like what an ellipse, but this one is not equated to one, but rather right, it's equated to one. This one. So we are 
just lay a part of the general thing. So, like, if the question is given to you that I post around these words, just put and confess. The last one, the electric. Parabola. I want us to generate a certain parts of the here. So with the electric pole and the electric paraboloid, this how look at the resemblance. With the electric paraboloid, the gen that this C will just not have a square, but the same thing will be repeated. Yes, it's a pattern. So just the this. With the electric pole, the three here is having a square. Everything also with a square, but the elliptic parabola is still not have a square. So I take the same comments. This is another shower that we are doing. I didn't know who did it, but I didn't like it. I said, We're back, not we're back. Of course, it's not a <laughs> they move on towards hyperbolic towards hyperbolic towards parabola. Now, let's look at how it's also linked with the elliptic. Let's look at something. That's why I think who did not like systematic. So they say they see everything that's happening on one square. Yes, so they see that as not happening. So they take the format like this. So they see also not happening. But with this, we know from ancient days that with hyperbolic, it will always have what? A minus. So but here, the y comes to the minus. I have a the matter going to minus. I will interchange the x and y. Then you compare and find your sentence on your radius and 
I think I should help you with a general form of hair. A little bit. So first of all, the ellipse. Let's do the ellipse first. The ellipse. You did it for ellipse. And this one, I didn't know it was what's going on. So, the most time. So, let's put the normal ellipse. And I did it. I to the one sheet. So with the one, so with the one sheet type, I'm going to take the form like the, the ellipse. Let's see, form like the ellipse. By operating one sheet, that means one of the negated. So the negated one is where it is directed to. So they, it can be asked also in the original question. Maybe they, it can be quoted in this book. It's not always